Hello, Possum Stranger Smith here in Alpha Craft, and you can see where I am. I'm in our temple in the Nether. I'm now in the mood to finish some things. Actually, no, let's be honest. I'm in the mood to finish this thing. So we're going to do that. Now, the last few weeks have been really hectic. They've also been really noisy. That's why you've had so many third person time lapses, and frankly, why there's been so much dungeons. We're going to do a third person time lapse again today because the building site up the road is just about to kick into gear. So I'll grab some blocks, we'll go into third person mode, and let's get building. So that's the hall done. I'm um, not quite done. We'll get to that wall. But the rest of it done. I have started making a little bit of a plateau out here. I'm not going to do the full plaza. It's too big a job. <laughs> I don't have it in me. Not right now anyway. Something for the future. But at least we don't fall to our doom when we step out the door. And I do still have to make doors. I'll get to that. But what I want to do next is this end wall. So the idea is that you enter either from the plaza or you come down from the Wither Skeleton Farm above. And we'll talk about the Wither Skeleton Farm above. And then there's this area. So we've got steps up for where you can make supplication. But the question is, supplication to what? That's what this shulker box is about. So up we come, um, I'll put it down there in the middle. We can get rid of this now, this is just a marker block. I want some black concrete to start with and I want to start right in the middle. Um, oh, and I've got to dig out one, 
two, three. And, oh, I have to work out, excuse me a minute, helps if I get measurements done, oh, that one, helps if I get measurements done first. One, two, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and then another three, and then another seven. One, two, three, four, five, six, six. oh. Just as well I checked. Just as well I checked. All right, let's do this again. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. If we make the bottom bit eight, then one, two, three, then one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. That should, yep, that's the top. Hooray, okay. Always worth checking first. So we come out and we take that one out. I need my grey concrete. Grey concrete. So one, two, three, four, five, six. And one there. Um, working with black concrete is its own little special difficulty. Okay. Down we come. This can come out because it's now going to get in the way. And we'll put it up here. Now I need to dig out some of the wall. All right, how's that looking? That's not looking too bad. I may have to shift this row. Uh, I think I will shift that row. All right, executive decision. I'll just build this and then I'll fix up the back wall. Ow! That was unbelievably stupid. All right, and I will not walk into the propitiatory flames. Propitiatory propitiatory flames. I won't do that. I won't walk into the burny things. Okay. So that's going to move, but we'll move it later. We'll get on with this. Can you guess what I'm doing? <laughs> Apart from being bonkers. All right. Now for the next bit. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. One, two, oh, yeah, and here we hit the problem of black concrete. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. One, two, three, four, five. So we put it there. No, we don't. Like I said, the problems of black concrete, we put it there. No, wrong. Oh, not doing well. All right, now we need white. Uh, four, I think. And then two more black. Uh, this is hard to remember. All right, I'll show you what I've done in a minute, but I'm just showing you what I'm going to do with the tops of all of these because there are, you guessed it, three heads. I may as well say it, I'm building a large wither freeze. <laughs> but I am spawn proofing up here with a mixture of grey carpet and black carpet. So I've 
got to put one more piece of black carpet there. Then I've got to finish this. What colour goes there? That. So then we can put the grey carpet in. Blah. And I've got to work out what to do with this. Because we'll be able to see up inside. Um, definitely this. And then uh, I think I do this. And then I do this. I think that's what I do. And now I can finish this off. So what do I need to finish it off? Some cyan terracotta. And that's all fixed. Two bits of black concrete. Ouch. Head number one. Just got to do the other two. Now, before anyone says, hang on, you know, that's concrete, that's coloured, blah, blah. It was really, really common for stone statues and stone buildings and wooden statues and wooden buildings for that matter to be painted. There's actually pigment left, you know, tiny scraps of it on ancient Greek and Roman statues and buildings, certainly on medieval ones until you get to churches that became Protestant churches and they tend to have been whitewashed but there's a lot of paintings underneath. So I initially made these in stone and it all just disappeared into grey against the walls. So these ones are painted. Let's build the next one. That's two of the three, and they're basically made the way that the wither is. The middle one I've had to modify because it's eight blocks wide and its body's three wide. And when you're doing coding, I'm sure you can easily center an even numbered thing over an odd numbered thing. I don't have that luxury. <laughs> so I've had to make the main wither head seven blocks wide instead of eight. So there are some slight changes. I'm just going to build it and then I'll show you. There we go. That's it. One with a freeze. Painted because statues and buildings were often painted. But it's done. The whole temple is now done. Well, the whole temple is almost done. I've got the doors in. Yes, the nether brick, there's nothing wood here. No point having wood in the nether. The doors here are permanently shut. Maybe there was a statue there. There certainly isn't now. I haven't done the plaza. I may not do the plaza. I might do the plaza. Maybe the plaza fell away in an earthquake. Who knows? And I haven't got that done. I haven't got that done for a good reason for the same reason that I've still got a strip in the middle here. When the 116 update comes out, which will be soon, that with the skeleton farm, two thirds of it is gonna be useless. Two thirds of it is not gonna work and the one third that does will be patchy because the spawning of wither skeletons is gonna change. And it would be very, very fussy to fix this. So I'm quite happy for that wither skeleton farm to just go south and someone else to make one using new mechanics and when that happens I can take out this top part of roof and I can make arches and I can work out run 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 I can work out how to make that fit in better preferably without this platform so this temple is now finished until 116 comes out and we do minor tweaks, this is finished. I will not be changing any of this. This 
is finished. It's done. Hooray. This has been such a big project. And thank you all for coming along on it with me. I'd love to know what you think of this. Tell me in the comments. Some things I'm not too keen on, this stripiness. Maybe that could go. Maybe I could do something else. I don't know, but uh, let me know what you think. Some things aren't changing. That's not changing. I really like that. And I really like that, even though it's stripy. <laughs> ah, so, Overworld Madness next time, not Nether Madness. If you want to join me on that, make sure you've subscribed if you haven't. Um, there'll be cards on the end screen now. Click the link to go see some more of the things that I get up to. Uh, hit the like, it really does help. And I'll see you next time. Bye.